Hi, welcome back to Yakuza Kiwami. Today, we're doing a really long side quest. So, uh, yeah, this, this, uh, scary-faced punk is harassing the slim woman over here. Slim woman? See, it does, just doesn't sound as good as evil woman. <laughs> Slender woman? It's no, that's gonna draw too many parallels with Slit- or- Wood. That, that's gonna make people think of Slender Man. Ooh. Don't sully this game. Huh? Man, remember when that kind of sweater was in style? No. Uh, <laughs> you lucked out. <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna beat the shit up out of Psyche. <laughs> Not terribly hard. What a pushover. Yeah, basically. え、ほら、誰だこの男。知らないわよ、こんな人。この野郎。俺が知らないうちに男を作り上がったな。違うんだって、純ちゃん。あ、すまん。余計なことしちまったか。俺はてっきり。この女性と俺は何も。覚悟はできてるかちょっと、純ちゃんやめてやめてよよせ、落ち着けやめてーおい、そんなもん出してどないするギアうおーはんせいどうやどうだはんせい、参ったか<笑> いいでででででおいちょっとお前さあ今のうちに逃げてそうじゃねえっていうかやめろいいでいいでよそちらの女性も怖がっている女性を連れて逃げなさい私なら大丈夫こういうやからはきっちりと正気しないと違うんだ人の話を聞けほら何やってるんだあお参りさんご苦労様です実はチンピラがカップルを脅しておりましてうぅ大丈夫ね大丈夫なのどどういうことまあカップルのチワゲンカってやつだなあああの二人がカップルってことは脅してたチンピラってのはお前かはいや勘違いだ俺も初っ端に勘違いしたが署まで同行してもらうぞ違うんだ一緒に警察に行きましょうは私も勘違いをしたそしてあなたも勘違いをしたここは男らしく
チンピラをやっつけちまったそうですなるほどもういいかすみませんでしたいやもういいですいやそれでは許されないそうだ私に同じ技をかけてくださいいや好きな技を好きなだけかけてもらってさあ遠慮なくさあ<笑>すまなかったなあんたには迷惑かかっちまったいえそれにしてもすごい技だったな柔道をやってたのかでは篠原さん最近は物騒ですからお気をつけて篠原なんで名前をあんた有名なのか現役はもう引退してましてそれでまあちょっとした観光にでもこういう場所を歩くのは慣れていないんで迷ってるうちにさっきの現場に出くわしまして本当にご迷惑をおかけしまして申し訳ありませんそうだったのか迷惑かけたついでだ俺でよければ案内するぜ本当ですかよろしくお願いしますはい。Okay, so where we want to go is、uh, way up in the northeast part of town to this barbecue joint. I wonder how they approach this guy. Or, like, we want you in our game. Yeah, probably. There's a lot of celebrity cameos in the Yakuza series. <laughs> like, there was even a contest they held, like, a popularity contest to determine a bunch of、uh, celebrity cameos in Yakuza Zero. That's pretty cool, actually. And Yakuza 6 and Yakuza Kiwami 2 have a bunch of Japanese wrestlers. <laughs> El Desperado better be in this game. <laughs> so, since Shinohara is、uh, a, a famous judo master,、um, he's loaded, so he's treating. I mean, even if he couldn't pay, he could just beat the shit out of everybody. <laughs> no, I'm cleaning out your kitchen. <laughs> I feel like they would have a lot more meat than just one full cow in the kitchen. Also, like, come on. Even. <laughs> even if they had an entire cow to give you, a lot of meat. You <laughs> want. I like that they can only give salt or salt pepper or sauce with one whole like cow. I like how it's not like it's not like soy sauce or anything, it's just mysterious sauce. <laughs> look, look, they're not、wow. gonna tell you the secret to their uh their Korean barbecue sauce. I mean, it's so secret they wouldn't even show us the cutscene of them eating. Please don't melt my poor PS4. They'd. I don't, need the, I don't need to see them render like every single plate. Well, I mean, you just like, <laughs> you just have a pile of dirty plates consistently pile up <laughs> as it like fast forwards and they just like look like they're talking. Actually, wait, no, they, they haven't shown, once shown like any of、uh, an actual model of food in this game. It's always, whenever we go eat, it's always just like watching Kiryu's back. Hmm. As he conveniently obscures the food. If only they had Cloud Imperium Games technology where they could pre procedurally generate food. Procedurally generated food? 
Hey! It's it's a long story. <laughs> Okay, so next stop is a cabaret club. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not fight the girls. <laughs> he just goes in, starts beating the host. Oh, no. Well, then why didn't she yell it when we entered the restaurant? Maybe she did. Check. Oh, I know. Kiryu was surprised. So. Checkmate. <laughs> Damn. Maybe we we're supposed to come here first and we sequence broke. No, he said he said we wanted or he said to go eat first. Now, now I'm just imagining him like walking into a library or a bathroom and just shouting, let's have a good fight. <laughs> Damn you constipation. Let's have a good fight. Right, sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. You're disturbing the our uh, readers here. Oh, and if he's late to a movie? <laughs> it's only entering the room, though. Presumably, like, the building. Well, I'm going to interpret it as entering every single room in that building. <laughs> <laughs> Walk into the lobby, let's have a good fight. Uh... Walk into. <laughs> Due to my debilitating know. habit, I can't work in an office. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, sir. You one of those TPS? Let's have a good fight. Reports. Let's have a good fight. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, he's uh splurging on the good stuff. <laughs> We should watch other people beat other people more often. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what could have happened if we'd gone into that cabaret club. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to know if this is like an accurate portrayal of this guy. I I I, I hope he does actually shout, "Let's have a good fight" in real life. Or that he's just like a secretly a party animal. <laughs> Disney World. Uh, but Tokyo Disney's closed by now. All right, uh, I can shorten it down to one word: roller coaster. Hmm. Like we just need Majima to pay like hundreds of contractors, <laughs> after hours billing, to set up a roller coaster in the city. Hey, 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 hey! You're like three years too early for uh, the rise of Majima Construction. Like, if he can organize a zombie attack, mm. that should be well within his grasp. Oh, no, it is, but he will have a dedicated uh, construction company <laughs> a little bit down the timeline. Oh, my God. It's amazing. More of that whenever we get to Kiwami 2, though. So. Oh, I know where we're going. Yup. Outer yeah. heaven. Hell yeah, we're gonna go beat the shit out of Venom. I have time to show that jerk who's boss. But yeah, he 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 wants a good uh thrill, so we're, we're gonna go to Fight Club. And this is so the start of a movie where the where the judo master is going to be like, you know what, I missed this, and he's going to train real hard to get back into the sport. <laughs> but his love of spending catches up with him, and he becomes en enthralled with their, you know, riddled with debt.
Also, he didn't say let's have a good fight, so I don't believe his story. Damn. So, yeah, he's really happy that, uh, he got to see Fight Club. Aw, we're somebody else's best friend. <laughs> so, yeah, surprise, surprise, uh, he's gonna get into the ring. <laughs> oh, I fucking called it. Hey! No, you didn't. There's no training montage here. Ah, uh, that's garbage. He's just going for it. I'm dropping my 10 out of 10 to 2 out of 10. <laughs> he also destroyed it there in the ring, so he didn't need that training montage. Yeah, but we didn't get to see it. You gotta stop doing this, Yakuza. <laughs> Show, don't tell, as they say. Well, that's okay. We'll we'll get to see him in the ring. Yeah, because we'll be fighting him. There you go. Well, I'm glad one. I'm glad one of the three of us here picked up on it. Many. And it made me feel so alive. I just had to get back into Cheeto. Hey! Is it weird that the people that we get along with the most are the ones that want to fight us all the time? You know, I never thought of it like that. All right, so we have a chance to go, I guess, prepare before we go fight Shinohara, but we're just going to do it. Uh. Although it would not be a bad idea to make sure you've got enough uh, healing items. I, I, I think you can use healing items against him. Oh, come on. Don't cheap it in. So, he's a... He's got three health bars. Well, more like two and a half. He's also very prone to grabbing you, so uh, watch out for that. I mean, oh, he's he can... a judo master after all. Yeah, and he gra his throws are fast. Like once he grabs you, you're you're getting you're you're just getting laid on your ass. Hmm. It's very rude of us to do to our new friend. Hey, he's the one who threw us first. Yeah, but we more more or less propelled him with the power of our foot to his jaw. <laughs> eh, he'll be fine. See? Oh, I actually broke out of that grab. So yeah, just he's he's very slow and lumbering. So just um, it's it's he telegraphs this attack. So just. Stay on your feet, keep dodging, and you'll have it basically down pat. You know, I'm a little surprised because judo, at least as far as I was taught, doesn't doesn't really have you like having these wide windmill e punches. Yeah, I thought judo was all throwing. <laughs> it's it's mostly throws, throws uh, and grapples. But then again, since we're uh. This is like a video game. I guess we they had to um, you know. Uh They had to expand his moves that a little bit so he did more than just try to throw you. Uh I figured he'd be just like a very good like counter boss. Right? Where like maybe he'd be in a defensive posture and then if you waited him out or just like kept trying to like wear him down, then he might like change attitude like he is right now. Uh yeah, I guess I, I guess that could work too. I don't know if I would like to would have liked him being like a counter heavy boss though, because that that would probably mean he's um 
most, or he's really easy to take out by ironically just throwing him all over the place. Mm. Hey, yeah! well, and mean, also, bosses in this game are annoying anyway, so. Yeah, but that's just because of the health regens. Yeah, I don't think uh, Shinohara can actually regen, so we're probably okay there. No, thanks. Hey! That, that for sure is something I'd be worried about. Yeah, like that that's a natural concern, but I don't think Shinohara can. Like most other bosses probably would have started by now. Ah, <laughs> uh, you gotta finish him off with dragon. Can I do that instead? Mmm. Seems disrespectful. <laughs> Man, that was a quick transition. Yeah, it was. And that's how that fight could have gone had we fought. <laughs> Let's get ready for a good fight. Actually, holy shit, why didn't he say that at the start of the fight? Um, Because they would have had to throw up a text box and they can't really do that super gracefully in uh, this engine, I guess. Come on, they should have given him like a special animation. <laughs> Just speak. let's get ready for a good fight. Yeah, they, they should have. Yeah. So yeah, Shinohara's just gonna stay at Fight Club for, until the end of time now. Shinohara or Goku? Dun dun dun! <laughs> Look, he he ate an entire cow. He's probably <laughs> Goku. <laughs> okay, well, Shinohara will stay here at least until uh, 2007, I guess, according to Wikipedia, when he starts teaching judo at his alma mater. Alma mater? I don't know how to pronounce that, actually. I always heard it as alma mater. Okay. And yeah, he's now an opponent we can fight in the arena. Do you get anything special for beating him, or...? I don't think so? 